You know, that was the great show with Ralph Cramden and Norton. And they Robin, play it, what do you think? They play it all the time. I'm going to say no. Really? Oh. I guess I'm going to go with no because I was going to say yes right away. So I'm going to say no. Even though the guy at the beginning says, The Honeymooners. I know, but he got that Andy Griffith thing. Yeah, he sure did. Yeah. It's I don't know if you. you would watch that. I know, it's up to me, but maybe I'll stick with you on this one. All right. You going with no or yes? Yeah, I'll go with no. I, you know what? I got to speak to you. It doesn't even matter if I win that thing. It's cool enough. I already won. All right, so do you want to go with no? You want to go with yes? You want to hang up the phone? I'm going with Robin. No. All I'm right, okay. No. You said um, you no, I'm going with no. All right, so the, she's going with no. Lock her in on a no, Fred. Here we go. It's time to hear Beatles' answer. Oh, that that's the fucking honeymooners. Oh! Yes! Wow. You got knocked right, right out. You know, it's funny. This game is a 50-50 chance, and yet you got I all know. of the three wrong. It's not all so easy. All of them wrong. No, it's you know, people not. are sitting in their car saying, "I could win the Beetlejuice game," but you now, that, and I bet you said that too, didn't you, Stacy? But I let me tell you, I have a college degree. Yeah, and I yet, really and that does that. you no good at all with the Beetlejuice. <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> in fact, I've uh, not even gone to college. No, uh, you wasted your time. All right, Stacy. What college was well, that? You, oh, I went to Adelphi. No, yeah, well. Oh, Gary's <laughs> alma mater. <laughs> Yeah. All right. But anyway, thank you for your bowls. Oh, you're so welcome. I hope you um, find them, maybe, and you use them. And like I said, come and paint one day. Yes. Thank you very much. You're very welcome. What am I doing? I'm going and painting? You're going to paint some pottery so you have uh, bowls. For I mean, your lovely woman, but gee, I was having a hard time with her. Well, I didn't get to give away the SVS Prime Satellite Speaker System. Do you here. have any more Beetlejuice games? Let me see how many I got. One, two, three, four. I guess I could play uh, the best. Uh, two out of three. I can put up another one, Howard. You can? All right, put up another one, and I'll play one more time, because I do want to give away the SBS Prime Satellite Speaker System, valued at 9999999. Nine, 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 nine. <laughs> no, 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 no. SVSound.com. That's S as in sound, V as in volume, sound.com. All right, Liz, you ready to play? You're not going to hock me in China with bowls? Howard, two Hello? years ago I sent you bowls. I, I don't remember those bowls. I don't think I ever saw them. Right, Robin? Right. I'm sorry that you didn't see her bowls. I like that she uh, considered Adelphi a college. That's kind of cute. <laughs> All right, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, I got five now up. Liz, you want to play? Yes, I do. Hey, now. All right, Liz is from North Carolina. What do you do out there in North Carolina? I am a retail manager. I actually moved out from New York, so I like to say I'm still from New York, but I would I'm imagine now. <laughs> if you move to North Carolina from New York that your your cost of living goes down and that you get, like, it, like do you live in a house or an apartment? I live in a house, but, you know, I kind of miss out on all the fun things. Like, I'd be able to see you at America's Got Talent all the time. And, you know, you could just hop in your car and drive out to the city. Here, there's not much but alcohol. I got to tell you, you know, I believe I would do better in a place like North Carolina. First of all... What do you mean? Well, I don't care about going out. Like, I don't go to theater. I don't go to movies. I, I do everything in my house. So, if I was in North Carolina, um, all my costs would be down. I'd probably have a place that's like a, a huge palace, right? And it would, oh, almost, yeah. it would cost me almost nothing. You'd say that, but then it just gets really boring. <laughs> no, I'm never bored. I, everything I do takes place in my house. But, you know, maybe there's going to... Well, North Carolina is a pretty good-looking state. Well, then again, I'm sure your house is a lot nicer than most of ours. So yeah, I mean, as it. long as I have my own room, I'm fine. <laughs> I was just thinking that maybe the scenery would not inspire you, but I'm sure... No, sure it would. You could find pictures of something. I like North Carolina. I've never been there, but I like it. Anywhere in the United (laughs) States, I like. (laughs) Not every place in the United States is so picturesque. I I disagree. Oh, what? Name a place in the United States that, like, Idaho, you would think is like, oh, it's flat, but they have beautiful uh, barns you could paint, and they have... Ohio. What's wrong with Ohio? Ten soldiers and Nixon coming. <laughs> Four dead in Ohio. All right, Liz, you ready to play or not? 
I am. All right, this is for SES uh, system, sound system. Here we go. We played Beetlejuice, the following uh, theme song. I didn't know we'd take up the whole show with this game. I thought someone would have won by now, but here we go. <laughs> I'm here on Gilligan's Island. Gilligan's Island. Hmm. Um, I am going to say that Beetle knows it. All right. Put her down as a yes. Lock her in. She says Beetle knows it. I got to figure he knows this, too. Yeah, I mean, this is a show that's on TV, and as you know, we play him actually this passage that says Gilligan's Island. Here on Gilligan's Island. All right, let's see what Pete says. He says... Oh, the Gilligan Island. Bro. Perfect. Yeah, great. All right, all right. All right. Something that makes sense out of all of this. You know, we have a giant ladder here in the studio, and you've just gone up one step on the ladder. Air The goal of an SVS Prime satellite speaker system valued at 999.99. Okay. <laughs> all right, here's the second one. Simpsons, everyone's favorite cartoon. And it is a cartoon. And it is a cartoon. Hmm. Well, I am going to go with yes. All right. Lock her in on a yes. I don't know why I feel the opposite way. Yeah, I'm not <laughs> sure about this one. Let's see what it is. Here we go. That's the low boat. I know what it is. You can't tell me. You can't fool nobody. The love boat? What? The love boat? I thought he said the low boat. No, he said love boat. Well, let me hear that again. That's the love boat. I know what it is. You can't tell him. You can't wow. fool nobody. It does sound a little love boatish, doesn't it? I guess so. The name The Simpsons, though, you think would <laughs> cue him in. Clue him in. All right. I mean, I think about it all the time they talk about The Simpsons and the wrap up show. He'd have some kind of, I don't know. Yeah, the, the odds of, uh, the odds of uh, Beetlejuice hearing the wrap up show would be slim to none. All right. Okay. All right, here we go. Here's the third question. You have one right, one wrong. Here we go. Sunday, Monday, happy days. Tuesday, Wednesday, happy days. Now, happy days, a very popular show. Oh, man. He has to know this, right? I'm, I'm going to go with a yes. I'll give you this clue. He knows what he knows because he's Beatle. Okay, yeah, that really says a lot. <laughs> no. All right, so you say he knows. So you want to lock gonna in on I'm going to say yes. Yard? Okay. All yeah, right, I'm going to lock in. Lock her in. Feeling oh, that's a fun. good bet. Sorry, Robin? I said I'm feeling that's a good bet. All right, let's see. Oh, the fudge, brother. The happy day. There yeah. you go. Oh, good. Go. All right. Two right, one wrong, and you got okay. three. Le- you got, you got um, two left. You got two left. Okay. Now, Sesame Street. Mm. Huh. Now, you figure GB must watch that because he kind of operates on a childish type level. And I know. You'd think he's like on the same brain activity. As this like would a be like a news <laughs> program to him. Right. But, you know, <laughs> this would enrich his life. Uh, but on the other hand, is Beetle really going to sit there and be interested in learning anything? Is he interested in Big Bird? Or, or that count uh, counting puppet. <laughs> So, hmm, I think I'm gonna go with a no. You're gonna go with a no. All right. Well, let's lock her in on a no. She's got two questions left, and uh, if you get this one right, you win because you got two I'm right. Very excited. Yeah. Here we go. Let's hear Sesame Street. You said no. Yeah, she said, I said no. no. All right. We don't want Sesame Street. Here we go. I think he's gonna know it. Let's see. Oh, my name is Fred. My name is Fashion and Son. It is Fashion and Son, man. Oh. Well, you win, right? That's amazing, yeah. What did he say? I don't he was know. trying to say Sanford and Son. Oh. Because they sound so similar. <laughs> well, uh, Liz, you've won this incredible SVS Prime satellite speaker system. Congratulations. I am so excited. Something yeah. actually happened in Charlotte here. Here's Gary to tell you what it's worth. Go ahead. Nine, nine, nine. Point nine nine. Yeah, I thought Fred would have hit the sour <laughs> shoe thing, but I guess we're not on the same wavelength today. Yeah, nine 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 dot nine nine. Now I have a small request because I'm here all alone in Charlotte, and it took forever to win. Could you throw in a flat Ronnie too? All right. Do we have any? Do we have a flat Ronnie, uh, Gary? Not currently. Uh, sorry. Uh, oh, do we have any okay. Ronnie magnets? Ronnie magnet. Do we Ro- have that, Jason? 
Yes. All I right, you can have a Ronnie magnet. refrigerator magnet, which is just wonderful. As good. Oh, that's um, fantastic. So I'm thank you. Him in every post on Twitter. SVSound.com, uh, SS and Sound, V is in volume, Sound.com. All right, hold the line, will you? Thank you, Howard. There you go, Liz. Well, finally, somebody won the Beetlejuice game. You know what? Put Ronnie in a box and just send her that. <laughs> Gotta hang Ronnie on the. You know, by the way, you know that um, when we played the Simpsons theme, Beetlejuice thought it was the Love Boat theme, and who would have thought he knew Love Boat? But just for uh, just for kicks, here is the Love Boat theme. Love we did happen to play that for Beetlejuice as well. Do you think he knew it? No. Oh, that's Love Boat. I already See? know about that. He oh, knew. he did know it. He knew. But why would he say The Simpsons is the love boat if he knew the love boat? Why don't you go ask him? <laughs> All right, Robin. So uh, there it is. Liz won the SVS Prime Satellite Speaker System valued at $999.99. All right, we've got to take a little break, so I'll do that. And then we'll, of course, be back. From all of us at the Beetlejuice TV theme game show, we wish you adieu. Fireworks. My son 